Regular automobile springs are good for about 200,000 compression and expansion cycles. That's a year of driving. Train springs can handle up to half a million cycles. But new generation springs have a service life that is 20 times greater. And there are other advantages. Working in low temperatures, the new generation heavy duty springs can handle twice the stress of their predecessors. The enormous strength of the springs is accomplished through high temperature thermomechanical processing of the steel. During heating, with high frequency currents and hot coiling, and then subsequent processes of curing, hardening and tempering, the metal goes through many phase transformations. Combined with special technological conditions, homogeneous nano-sized substructures form in the steel grain. Carbides of only 7 to 10 nanometers appear in the steel. They are much smaller than those obtained through conventional processes. They imbue the metal with considerably greater strengths. The size of the subgrain of the ferrite matrix, 20 to 40 nanometers, also contributes to the steel's strength. In fact, no element of the substructure reaches 100 nanometers. The principle is simple. The smaller the substructure, the stronger the steel. Rusnano will invest 830 million rubles in this project. The plant where the heavy-duty springs will be manufactured is in Izhevsk in the Republic of Udmurtia. The company expects to reach design capacity in early 2012. Earnings from the sale of springs in 2015 are forecasted at more than 4 billion rubles.